Dear students, in this unit, we will talk about the harmful impacts of prokaryotes on humans. As we all know that some prokaryotes are human pathogens. They cause different diseases. In fact, almost half of the human diseases are caused by bacteria. Now, most of these diseases are caused by bacteria when we ingest them directly or indirectly through food or through the air. But some of the bacteria, they, are, they could, could be carried by some other organisms as well. Just like we talk about Lyme disease, Lyme disease is caused by bacteria, but actually carried by the ticks, which infect humans and result in the Lyme disease. Now, pathogenic prokaryotes, they typically cause disease by releasing different exotoxins or endotoxins. Exotoxins are actually the toxins uh, which causes diseases and they could cause disease even when the bacteria or pathogen is not present. But endotoxin can only cause disease when bacteria dies and that part of bacteria is released and act as the endotoxins. Now, different uh, when we talk about the harmful impacts of prokaryotes, the major portion is the spoilage of food. For example, souring of milk, rotting of vegetable and meat. Majorly, it is caused by the bacteria. And then, reduction of soil fertility. There are some denitrifying bacteria which actually release the... Uh, which release... Um, the soil nitrates and ammonia into the free nitrogen into the air. The example is Pseudomonas aeruginosa. The nitrogen uh, containing nitrates and ammonia, it increase the fertility of soils. But these denitrifying bacteria, they actually release these nitrates into the air as a free nitrogen. So they reduce the fertility of soil. Then these prokaryotes, they actually, due to the horizontal gene transfer, they can spread those genes which are associated with pathogenesis. They have efficient mechanism of acquiring those genes from each other and they could cause more virulence in humans. Some of the pathogenic bacteria they could be used as potential weapons of bioterrorism. The famous example is Bacillus anthracis, uh, which was in early 2000, which was used as mass weapon of bioterrorism.